Good morning, I'm Trish Pahanik and this is Synopsis, your first early morning briefing. Today is Wednesday, July 15, 2009. Here are today's top stories. Discovery Channel announced its series Pitchmen, which featured the recently deceased Billy Mays II and his business partner Anthony Sully Sullivan, will return for a second season. Because the series' first season with 12 episodes proved successful for the network, and as a way to honor Mays, the show will be back produced by Original Productions, a unit of Fremantle Media. Currently, the format for Season 2 is in development, and the Discovery Channel is working with May's son, Billy Mays III, Sullivan, and Tom Beers, CEO of Original Productions. Further details about the show will be announced at a later date, as well as the premiere date. Discovery Channel will also rebroadcast its special honoring the career and life of Billy Mays, Pitchman, a tribute to Billy Mays, on July 24th at 10 p.m. Reels Channel opens a new weekly series, Twilight Weekly Spotlight, focused on the popular Twilight movies premiering August 10th at 10 p.m. Naib Reynoso, Reels Channel correspondent and Twilight expert, will host the series, offering the latest news, cast interviews, and coverage from TwyCon leading up to the fall sequel release of New Moon. British comedian Russell Brand will once again host the 2009 MTV Video Music Awards, held on September 13th. This year's show will be shot around New York City's Manhattan, including Radio City Music Hall. Bravo and Evolution Media are ready to begin production on Season 5 of The Real Housewives of Orange County, the original version in the franchise. For the new season, Housewives Tamara Barney, Lynn Curtin, Vicki Gunvalson, Gina Kiao and Gretchen Rossi will be joined by new housewife Alexis Bellino, a 32-year-old stay-at-home mom and socialite who originally hails from Hannibal, Montana. Plans are in the works to make a feature film based on the 1960s Western TV series The Big Valley. Producer Kate Edelman Johnson, daughter of the TV show's co-creator, producer Louis F. Edelman, is putting the pieces in motion with an April production start date. Johnson's and Daniel Adams' production company, Panther Entertainment, will produce. Adams also wrote the screenplay. The Big Valley originally aired on ABC from 1965 through 69, starring Barbara Stanwyck as the strong-willed matriarch of a ranching family and series regulars included Lee Majors, Richard Long, and Linda Evans. ABC's new mid-season mystery series Happy Town is in discussions with Stephen Weber to play a headlining role. Weber would portray John Haplin, an influential leader of the city and father of the girl kidnapped years before by the Magic Man. Additionally, Ben Snetzer was added to the cast to play Haplin's son, a wealthy teenager caught up in a star-crossed romance. ABC Studios produces the series. And on that note, be sure to check your email for the full printed version of today's synopsis with new executive moves and more on ratings, some new classified ads, a few other stories that did not make it into this podcast, and of course tonight's primetime broadcast lineup. This is a Synopsis Media production in association with 311 West. For Cynthia Turner, who wrote and compiled Synopsis in Connecticut, I'm Trish Pahanek. I'm going to have a good day, even if I make it myself, I'm going to have a good day. I don't need no one else. I'm gonna have a good day. Nothing wrong I could do. I'm gonna have a good day. Hope you have a good day too.